Jason from Wake Makers, and today I'm going to just talk about some of the differences between the Johnson Ultra Ballast Pump and the Jabsco Ballast Pumpy. Both pumps are reversible, flexible vane impeller pumps, so they function very similar. Uh, it's very common for our customers to compare these two products as they're trying to decide what makes the most sense for their application. So, um, first thing I wanted to no take note of is the physical differences and similarities. As you can see, very similar from a construction design standpoint. Um, the Johnson pump on the left here is slightly longer than the Jabsco, um, but it's not quite as large around and, and is a little bit lower um, when it's installed in the boat. Um, so uh, something to keep in mind if you have a really small constrained space and that's the only place you can put the pump, the Jabsco is probably going to fit a little bit better. Um, Johnson pump is slightly faster. It's already that th 3 gallons per minute more, 13 gallons per minute versus 10 gallons per minute. So you're going to get better flow out of the Johnson pump. So if you're filling a very large bag or if speed is, is your biggest concern, then this is going to be a higher capacity pump. From a durability standpoint, both pumps are, are very equal. Um, you know, like I said, similar design and construction, and we see similar reliability between the two. They're both very reliable products that we, we just don't have many problems with. Um, Biggest difference between them is probably price. That's pretty common. Uh, customers are you know, looking at the price between the two products and wondering why is the Johnson, which is actually a rated higher capacity, m less expensive than the Jabsco. So you're getting more speed out of the Johnson for less money. And the first thing that people assume is, well, the quality isn't the same. Uh, like I said, you know, from a construction standpoint, they both weigh about seven pounds. They're both very high quality pumps and, uh, and designed and built to last. So the biggest difference between them is what's included with the Jabsco and what's not included with the Johnson pump. So Jabsco includes this pre-wired switch connector with the switch in the box with the Jabsco ballast puppy. So you're getting this for the, for the price, you're getting the, the pre-wired switch, which saves you some time from an installation standpoint, as well as the switch itself, which is a, about a $20 value. So factor that into the decision when, you, when you're uh, you know, pricing them out and comparing them. Um, we do offer our pre-terminated switch block connector for the Johnson pump. This is part number 34021. You can find it on our website. So you, could, you can buy this separately, and we recommend that you buy it with the Johnson pump. And that will basically get you to the same configuration as uh, what comes in the box with the Jabsco once you purchase the switch. So this guy, uh, this sw pre-wired switch block is $19.99. And like I said, the ballast switch itself with the actuator on the front is just about $20. So by the time you add it all up, uh, the Johnson is actually slightly more expensive. And that makes sense. It's a little bit faster capacity pump. So just wanted to give some, some clarification there and an explanation uh, between the two pumps from a pricing standpoint to try and, uh, try and do a more apples to apples comparison. So hopefully that helps. Um, both pumps are great products. If you need a reversible pump, either one of these will do the job. We sell, you know, sell both of them. We wouldn't sell them if they weren't high quality products. So if you have any other questions about either one of these ballast pumps or uh, ballast pumps in general or setting up an automated system, feel free to get in contact with us. Our toll free number is 888-338-6085. And uh, you can always email us sales at wakemakers.com.